Okay, this is Joshua State of the U with Steve Sorensen, a freshman guard from Texas. Uh, okay, Steve, um, what are some big differences in playing high school ball versus practicing against your Canes teammates? I would say the main difference is the speed of everything. Everyone's just, it's taking the most athletic guys from their high school team, the most skilled, and then putting them all on one team. And so everything's just a lot quicker and you don't really have any room for error. You have to stay focused and really be sharp and attentive every play. So that's the main difference. Okay, and, and during practice so far, like who have you gone up against that has been a real challenge or more of a challenge than guys that you may have gone up in the past? Um, Obviously trying to guard Shane is something that's definitely a challenge. He's one of the quickest people I've ever had to play against and probably one of the quickest people in the nation. So that always keeps you on your feet. And that's been really helpful though and able to learn from him and other guys that have been able to go up against. So it's been good but challenging for sure. Okay. Um, where else were you recruited, and why did you choose to walk on at Miami? I was getting looks from a couple of Patriot League schools and Ivy League schools and looks like that. But my brother actually walked on to Virginia Tech, and he enjoyed his more big ACC experience as opposed to a smaller school like that. And I really wanted to go somewhere where I would be able to tell someone I went there, and they would know what school it was, and I could enjoy the atmosphere and have the camaraderie of a big environment like that and it really worked out and I'm grateful that it did. Okay, cool. Um, I, I read and I, I went to your site online that you had set up and I read that you shot 50% from uh, beyond the arc your senior year which is really impressive at high school, college, whatever level you're playing at. Um, what does it take to become a consistent three-point shooter? A lot of work and a lot of hours in the gym just working on form. I spend at least half an hour just doing form shooting before I actually start shooting threes and moving out. And it's really just getting reps so that it's in a game, it's not something that is challenging, it's just you've done it before in muscle memory. And then also just realizing that if you want to expand your game and be able to drive, people have to respect the shot and so you have to put in the time to get that going so that they can respect that threat also. Okay, um, besides, I guess, the heat, what are some of the biggest differences from life in Texas and life in South Florida? Um, the heat is definitely one of them, but it's more humid here. Well, I can't say I like the humidity. It was just dry heat in Texas, but I don't know. I lived in Dallas, and so that was kind of a big city, and this is Coral Gables, not as much, but Miami is a pretty busy area, so I'd say those are pretty similar. It's just, I really love the atmosphere down here, and it's just, I don't know, it sounds cliche, but the energy, the people are just really lively, and it's a great place to be.